Hello friend, welcome to my device youtube channel. So let's get started and what we have in this video. So in this video, we are going to be talking about very useful tool that is useful for information gathering. That is you can say DNS NU or some people might also call it as a DNS NU. Well talking about DNS NU give you more information about your target or you can say that website or domain. And it is also tried zone transfer which is a really great vulnerability but finding a zone transfer vulnerability is far nowadays because because they use any third party provider or cloud services but other than that it will give you some information about your target so dns nm is very useful there are some other tools also available but in this video we are mainly focus on DNS N. Here you can see this site hackthissite.org is one of the site which allow you to perform some tests. For the demonstration purpose, we gather the information from this site. And there are also another website is also available that you can use for for the your testing purpose. And if you really want to know more about this website, you can follow this link which is given in description and read all these instructions are given in that website so you can understand it. Alright, so we are talking about the DNS NM which was a really great tool and its name defined what it can do. Basically it scan all the DNS related information etc. Okay. Let me open the DNS NM from the terminal. So DNS NM, okay, hit enter. So here you can see it's pre already installed on Kali Linux if you have the updated version. So here you can see the versions of DNS NM uses options domain. You can also open the DNS NM from the here. Here you can see the information gathering DNS analysis here. So so let's see the uses of DNS NM. And it necessary to mention DNS NM at the first time. In the option, option it could be the general option like DNS server which use the DNS servers for a NSNMX queries, ename, edge for help, no reverse for the script time, subfiles, verbose, etc. All the information are available in here. And domain name. Next is the domain name. Domain name which could be the, your target website host address. So let's try some basic command. First we have to mention DNS NM. DNS NM okay now mention the our website target name we just try the small command basic command okay start working let's see yeah zone transfer query field yeah I already said that the zone transfer is difficult to get just because of third parties and software so this is our scanme.org host name, host address. Here IN means individual and A stands for the IPv4 IP addresses. If there is a 4A, then you can consider the IPv6 IP addresses. Here name servers. Scanme.org use Linode's name servers. And these are the subnets. Only last two digits are different. Okay, the mail server. It uses the titan.net mail server. Sometimes mail server is useful for the social engineering and performing boot force attack. If the mail server is vulnerable, then you can get a ton of your information of your victims, domains, etc. So let me clear this terminal and try the some advanced level DNS command so you can understand it easily. So let me first uh, specify DNS NM 
then the option it could be the DNS server so server for here we can use the Google public server IP and that Google public server IP could be the 8.8.4.4 or you can also use the 8.8.8.8 .8 which is a publicly available then next uh, we use the option no reverse no rev oh no pay okay all right so here you can see no reverse useful for this keeping the lookup operation so we can save our time so next we have to get a subdomain for this hyphen f files read the subdomain from the file so the file could be stored in computer so you, you can access the from the, this place computer now go to the usr directory now share directory now we have to search dns nm the first one is yeah here is your file dns text file all the subdomains are stored in this file for the boot force so the specify the location usr shares dns nm dns.txt so next uh, we have to store all this result report to the different file so the sub file command is used sub file so where we have to store i store in desktop desktop make a new text file new dot hang dot txt yeah it's good now specify the domain name now in this case the domain name is hack this site dot org Mm, like this site uh, record query failed maybe there is some mistake dns enum dns server 8.8.no dot no reverse all right as app user sr dns dns dot txt all right sub file yeah here is some minor mistake apologize for that here you can see the spelling mistake in domain name hack this site dot org okay it's performing obviously zone transfer will fail now he is trying boot forcing and uh, it will take little bit time and if you really want to see zone transfer there is another url is zone transfer dot me you can perform this dns nm also on that url so you can see the zone transfer vulnerability on that domain so the brute force will take time let me fast forward this video finally it's done we get more information from that domain so let's see here is a host address as i said host address and ip addresses name servers buddies name server use mail servers google mail server which is more secure zone transfer is failed so here is a boot forcing report so the performing on admin host form host IRC domains state domains ns2 mails yeah here is some c name here you can see c name here you can see c name you can also go at c link is a canonical if you try to access this url you can directly redirect to this url so that's mean then 
okay here you can see the all net ranges good that is really or here you can see all the website block IP addresses it's also the good so that's all about the gathering information from this domain hope you enjoy this video this is just for the demonstration purpose I made this video because there is nothing special to show all the uh, to perform all this command you can do it yourself it's very easy and make sure that you perform all this test on that URL which uh, which is a hack dot hack the site dot org zone transfer dot me scan me dot me etc all I specify in description and hope you enjoy this video hope you enjoy this video and don't forget to subscribe our channel and like this video